rocky view. Generally, uh, it's rocky view. Unbelievable. This is in um, Calgary Southwest. So we'll see see where we're at over here. Here we are. We're gonna have to monitor this thing. It was just deployed. We don't know what there's a generator over there, but We'll have to come back and check it out. There it is over there. Yeah, we'll put the details up of where this is, but it's Rocky View General Hospital. Someone contacted us. We just did a, a video from the parkade. We wanted to give you another perspective to put it in context of the general area. So. You know, it's kind of like the Ukraine proxy war now. They're, the arrogance coming out from the globalist deep state, they're just not hiding anything. They're, you know, it's so blatant now, and um, this is consistent with it. So what's, uh, what's next, folks? Look at it. But I don't want to trouble people with jargon, but, you know, this is called the unipolar rules-based world order. It's not made up. And it's connected 100% to uh, the World Economic Forum. And you can see everything that's going on with it. But there's no public input. They do whatever they want. And as far as we're concerned, they're making this technocracy. And uh, it's going to get a lot worse because we're at a very early stage, as we posted yesterday, like the radiation levels, they could be 100 times higher based on the standards with what's coming. So all we could do is raise awareness, and that's a good thing. Knowledge is power. But... This is the world we're living in, folks. There we are there. It's funny, it looks like they're still working on it. Because that one side is open there. So we'll have to come back and get the true readings on this thing. You see that, folks? They don't even have the antennas on that one part there. So we're going to have to wait till this thing is fully deployed, fully operational to get true readings on it. But there it is. Buzzing in his ear is going to get a lot worse. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to worry, folks, but check out our update on 5G. It just shows how high it can go. We can, They could take it up to 300 gigahertz if they want, right? So we're at a very early stage in this process of what they're up to. But it's all top-down, top-down, um, almost authoritarianism, what's going on. And the absolute arrogance of WEF, which was just on display, should worry a lot of people. The arrogance of these people. And what they're doing in Ukraine is unbelievable. The arrogance there, 
they're destroying that country. So with all the arms and they're, they keep escalating. And um, I want to be very clear, Russia is being targeted because it's not playing the WEF game. It's not into open borders. It's standing up for traditional, the traditional Russian culture and way of life. And they're standing up for their independence. So, therefore, they're, they are um, um, frowned upon by these globalists because they're, because they're not playing their game. I, I believe that 100%. That's why Russia is being targeted. So, you know, but praise on them for standing up for their culture, their way of life. And um, I hope they're successful. That's just my opinion. Yeah, exactly, Gene Francis. Well, that's what the globalists are saying too. F it. Because they're destroying it. Right? Let's face it, eh, folks? There it is there. I wanted you guys to see the context. Because like I said, the first video was up in the parkade. And now we're outside. This is in uh, Calgary Southwest. I'll put all the details up momentarily, Matt. So everyone stay safe, stay safe. Uh, it's a crazy world we, we're living in, you all know it. Look at the US dollar, it's dropping. So much debt. Things are happening, folks. Things are happening. The only good thing is the precious metals are going up. People are fl running to that to, to protect their wealth, right? Protect their barterability. That's what's going on now. So it is what it is. Uh, but I can't help from being concerned with the escalation in that proxy war, but we'll have to see where it goes. Uh, but it is what it is. I want to wish you guys the best. In about a week, we're going to head into the rural area. We, we found some pretty interesting stuff up there. But we're going to go up there in about a week. And uh, we got to document that. April, we're heading back to Toronto. We're meeting up with one of our uh, co-workers there. And um, we're going to spend about five days in Toronto. That's a, that's a mecca like New York. Uh, Los Angeles, uh, London, England, you name it. Um, that's a mecca for all this stuff. So it'll be really insightful to go there and document it. But we'll be there in April, mid-April. Mid so it should be pretty interesting. I want to wish everyone the best. Please stay safe. And please, please keep getting informed.